So, um, hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, and it's your boy Sky Newman again. Okay guys, I have 10 minutes to shoot this video to tell you about London because I have to fly to, New to California and I just came back from London, an 18 hour flight, I'm exhausted as a fork but at least I was in first class I can manage to get some rest there and food free food <laughs> you know, celebrity life ain't easy I, I thought it was so easy, you know, going to Met Gala's, going there and there. But it's, it's not easy, guys. You have to work your ass up. And, yeah, I'm going back to California because Kim called me and wanted to come. Like, um, she wanted me to come. They invited me to some shit that's happening there. And I, I, don't, I don't know. So I'll just meet, I'll meet my cousin. Tyler there. I hope he's invited though. So guys, for today I'm going to tell you how's London, how's that side, because my subscribers and viewers probably um, haven't been in London before. But I've been giving um, my fans brief because I've been posting London on my social media, on Instagram. So let me tell you about London. So, um, as y'all know, I was born in London, then three years I came back to um, Africa because my mom had, uh, I was accepted in a very expensive, like hard, like paying job had to come in, um, in South Africa and I was ex my mom lied to me you know I was expecting a lions tigers and and people have been saying that Africa is a wild area I was like thinking oh my gosh I love jungle and I've been watching the what, what the Lion King so I was like oh my gosh I'm gonna meet Zumba and so and I came to Africa in South Africa I was, I was so pissed because like the cities same as London everything everything's beautiful there's no wild area there, there's no tigers I'm not seeing lions are free they are always in the jungle like a little jungle I don't think there's a jungle in Cape Town it's a zoo apparently so I miss London it's been it's been what uh, how many years I think uh, 13 years I haven't been there in London I've decided let me go by myself not with family just to see for myself how's London okay I got in London um, everything's changed there my neighborhood where I was living for three years changed there and the people changed there you know but we not there. We move. So um, I met this guy in, in London. He's uh, apparently now my friend. He's Thomas Kinsella. He was taking. Uh, I was walking by the uh, the uh, zebra zebra lines in London near Buckingham, and I noticed this white guy is taking pictures of me. I I I am used to like celebrity paparazzi you know but in South Africa not internationally in London you know I was like uh, okay and he was continuously taking pictures of me walking like a paparazzi shot and I came to him I was like Tom, uh, um, excuse me what are you doing you should have asked me because like I love photo shoots and I'm a model, a media influencer, celebrity, so you should have asked me to like okay, pose or something. What if I'm crusty in those pictures? Can I see them? I saw those pictures and they were stunning as fuck. And I was, I'm a fashion icon, so I don't disappoint in my drip. 
and he introduced himself. He's Thomas Kinsella. He's German, and uh, he currently lives in London. And he knows about me because you know I'm an, an international model, an interna international celebrity, you know, and people from overseas quite know me but I think like 20% of celebrities from um, overseas know me you know Kim knows me Kylie Tiger I don't know there's many so um, I, I got to meet Thomas and we eventually became friends Yeah, he told me that he's, he's from German, but he came to live in London. I don't know, etc, etc, etc. So he's like, okay, can I, every, every day you here in London? I was like, you know, I came to visit here. So, it's like, okay, can I shoot you? Because it seems like you a fashion icon. So I would like to shoot you every day when you're here, before you leave. Because I was like, okay, I can give some, some feedback from my fans, you know, where I am, my pictures, you know. So the first shoot, it was brilliant, amazing, stunning. And the next shoot was, okay, quite well. It was awesome, basically. You know, I never disappoint. I'm a fashion icon. I'm fucking Scott Norman. No one fucks with me. Just know that. I'm the big fucking Scooby Doo. So, um, day three in London, I, I had an important meeting with Harry. You guys know him as Prince Harry. I went to Buckingham Palace and I had an important meeting there. I don't want to discuss it. The Rui family doesn't want me to discuss things. But like, we have a secret. I just want to give you like a small brief. Apparently, I have blood there because like, someone in, in the royal family is my father and I'm mixed. Uh, my mother was a maid there. In the Buckingham Palace, so a prince there got a relation. Was in a relationship with my mother, and you know, my father is a, is a royal guy. It's like I didn't know my father, and my mom was like, she was like those moms who are single moms, you know, and they don't want to tell. The history that they had and you know so we discussed it and I got to find out who my father is but I'm not gonna tell it I'm gonna I'm not gonna tell media I mean royal family wouldn't like that I'm royal <laughs> I'm Scott Norman don't fuck with me okay so I was happy in London I got to, uh, I I managed to uh, to know my father well you know okay after the meeting I went to Thomas we took other pictures at this restaurant in bootleggers and it, it's an English restaurant it was so nice, the pictures there uh, were so flying, you know. And the food there is on top. And on social media, uh, on Instagram, I was like giving my fans brief, you know, how's London, I was videorizing every part of London. 
Oh my gosh, I'm in love with London. This is so nice. I'm gonna show it here and you as well. And you know, I went to, uh, day four in London. I went to my neighborhood and everything changed there, you know. But I'm back now. London was such an awful. I love London. London's my favorite city. That big fuck. London's amazing, guys. You know. The everything there. I got this Chanel. I got to buy my mom, but she's not here yet, so it's a surprise. The Chanel glasses. Yeah. And it was quite expensive, guys. Wow. But, like, I need to spend money on my mother. Chanel glasses. Because she hasn't been seen properly, you know. She has, like, an eye problem. So, I thought, let me buy my mom Chanel glasses. Spectacles, I mean. Um, in London, I, got, I gave her a present. Such amazing mom, and I love her for that. Fuck! My Uber's here, guys. Fuck! It's, it's not even 10 minutes. My Uber's here. I got to go to the. Uh, I have to go. Fuck! I have to go to the airport because I'm gonna miss my flight. To New York and Kim, I don't want to like get Kim angry because I have a great relationship with Kim, a friendship relationship. You know, I don't want to ruin it. You know? Thank, thank you guys for supporting me. I love it, guys. You know what? I thank you, Father God, for everything that you've done for me. I wanted to be a celebrity. I am a celebrity. I love you guys so much for supporting me. You know every now and then people want like i know this guy this is scott norman blah 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 and blah 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 and he's amazing a fashion icon he's um international model he's a media influencer and uh, quite an acting skill you know i fuck god fuck i love you guys i love your support and thank you god so much I've come so far in life and I'm so excited uh, I, I'm here to announce that they invited me to Med Gala 2021 fuck I love you fans I love you Scott Norman fans you are my I, I, I feel like crying you know I'm gonna go to the Med Gala <laughs> And Donatella Versace contacted me and was like, do you want like a costume? I wouldn't, you know, say no because it's Donatella Versace. So, she's going to make my costume. And, it, you know, I don't disappoint. I'm a fashion icon. So, I am going to kill it there. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm, I'm outside. Okay, I'm gonna come outside right now. I'm busy with YouTube. What? But it doesn't matter though. Okay. Okay. All this fucking Uber guy. She must wait. I love my fans. You know, I'm doing this YouTube video. Oh, this is Kim. <laughs> Hi, Kim. I'm 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 on my way to the airport right now. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna be there in 18 hours. Okay. Could you talk to Chris? Okay. Um, hey North! I miss you so much. How, how old are you now? Oh my gosh, I miss you. I can't wait to see you guys. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I didn't like you ended the show. I don't like that. I'm gonna speak to you about that when I come there. Okay. Okay, bye. Thank you, honey. 
Oh, I'm so excited. Fuck. I, I'm meeting Kim Kardashian again. My friend from back then. <clears throat> okay, guys. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you subscribe and show your friends and family, whoever, this video. You know. Thank you for watching this video. Thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much, guys. Amen.